Hi guys, welcome to Learn Electronics Repair. And you see today I have Detlef with me. Hey everybody, got my coffee with me. And I also have something on my desk. And although it looks like he's pointing at me, Detlef is responsible for this. Yep, yep, so, yep, yep. I thought Richard had this many PCs on the channel and I thought we can go smaller. What, you mean those Nook PCs? Yeah, the Nook things, yeah, they, oh. uh, yeah, they were fun. Yeah, they were fun. So, what's this? It's a... Uh, it's a USB stick, isn't yeah, it? It's a very pregnant, pre pregnant one, yeah. A very pregnant uh, USB oh stick. Oh no, oh no, no, sorry, it's a HDMI <laughs> stick. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys, we have a HDMI stick. So, come on, Jeff, what is this? Uh, let's show the people the listing on AliExpress. So, um, I was looking around for little computers, and I don't know, sometimes this hits me, and I thought, oh, these things were great some years ago. Mm -hmm. This Intel Compute Stick is the word for that. So it's a very anemic Z8350 CPU in there, which I think it's two cores or something. Okay. And back in the days, I remember I had one of those, and it was two gigabytes of memory and uh, 32 gigs of uh, flash RAM. Uh, so EM EMMC are called hard drive in these things. Ah, uh -huh. okay. But right now you get these for 60 bucks. bucks. And it says Windows 10. Yeah, there's a uh, Windows 10. Does this run Windows 11? Um, yes, it does. Mm, let me rephrase that. Does this run Windows 11 in a usable manner? Oh, now you're getting complicated, right? <laughs> okay, I think we better find out, guys. What do you think? Yeah. So, if you were thinking, how do I connect this to anything? Well, it's pretty easy because you see the big HDMI connector. This is what you mm -hmm. drop into your monitor or okay. TV or whatever so this, you're using. This pulls into the back of your monitor. Hmm? Okay. Yeah. And on the side, if we turn it a bit, yeah, there's a power switch, the little micro USB, so the thing that never, nobody uses anymore, uh -huh. is the power, which is actually 5 volt at 2 amps. Did it come with a lid? And it comes with a transformer in the box. Oh, it comes with a power yeah, supply. Okay, we'll yeah, look at that yeah. in a moment, yeah. Yeah, and then you got a normal USB 2.1 and a USB 3 something something. Mm -hmm. And on the other side, well, there's a uh, micro SD card slot, TF. Okay. And that's it. So, is this where you plug your mouse and keyboard in? Yep, you could. You could? Or does it have wireless built in for keyboard? Of course it has. It is Wi-Fi all the way. Yeah. Uh-huh. Because you can tell there's no network connection anywhere else, so mm -hmm. Wi-Fi is the way to go. Of course. Okay, so we could, for example, put a hub into here for mm -hmm. keyboard and mouse. Mm -hmm. Or use a, a wireless keyboard and mouse, mm -hmm. and we still have a USB spare. Yeah, yeah. And talking of interconnectivity, this is what's actually in the box. Mm -hmm. So we have a short HDMI male to female extension, mm -hmm. which is good because the pregnant one doesn't fit anywhere. Oh, yeah, you yeah. may struggle to fit it into your yeah. monitor directly. Yeah. Okay, and then this is the little power supply, guys. Yeah. So this is five volts, two amps. Yeah. And this has the little micro USB. Okay. These things were actually built for something like take your computer with you wherever you go. You only need an HDMI plug and you simply plug in and you're ready to roll. Uh, to have a whole environment with you. So mm -hmm. 64 gigabytes for um, uh, EMMC RAM. Is enough for a Windows installation? Okay. And you've put Windows 11 on here? Of course. Okay, then I think in that case we better plug this into my system here and let's see how it runs. Oh, this is booting up. No, it is. American Megatrends, like a BIOS. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I switched off all the fancy, fancy, schmancy things, and uh, yeah, there you see your Windows 11 coming up. And we can talk now for a bit longer because this will teach you to be humble. Ah, oh. <laughs> so it's going to take a while. Yes, this is a very polite thing to say. Yeah. So when you said it runs Windows 11, you more sort of meant it crawls Windows. It crawls, yeah. It crawls, okay. Yeah. yeah. I mean, this, when this came out, everybody was thinking, okay, does this really, does this really do anything? Does this really work? And yeah, it's, it's in German, sorry. Okay. Yeah, but uh, welcome means welcome. You know, it's hard to work that out. <laughs> Some people come here and go to the restaurant and get the Spanish menu and say, what the hell's an ambergesa? <laughs> you know, some people you can't help, can you? <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah. Yeah. Right, let that do that. Yeah. So the biggest, biggest question back in the days was, what is this really usable for? And uh, the question remains, 
what is this really usable for? Uh -huh. Well, I would have thought web browsing. Um, we can try this in a minute. Okay, because yeah. I would have thought if we wanted this on the workbench here, we probably will use it for viewing mm -hmm. schematics and for uh, web browsing yeah. to find schematics, and that's sort of, that's why I would probably want this in the workshop. Absolutely, yeah. So this would be first selection because everything is nowadays browser based, and um, yes, I tried MX Linux on this, and it didn't help because MX Linux. Uh, it's even worse optimized for, for this kind of machines. So web browsing, m meaning playing YouTube, mm, uh -huh. not good. Oh. And the next thing would be something like a present presentable thing in Magic. Mm -hmm. uh, so where you have uh, something like a point of sale or a TV monitor somewhere in a bar that simply plays back a video file okay. in, in on a loop. But we can try this in a minute. Okay. <laughs> we so try YouTube in a minute. Yeah, okay, you got your mouse. We got the mouse, so that way. Uh, would you like to give us a run? Uh, would, you, would you like to give us a walk around this? Uh, let's set, set up Wi-Fi first. So uh, I opened up MS Info 32 for because you probably want to know what's going on there. So okay, we got actually a Windows 11 Pro on this one. So right. this came from a Windows 10 Pro. I have no about no idea about how how really good this license is, but I don't care. Well, so uh, we got an Intel. Z8350 on this one, so this has four cores. Uh huh. Really four cores. Cool. But, uh, but uh, <laughs> yeah, if you look at the uh, 1.4 gigahertz, there's just not much coming out of uh, there. What about the turbo mode? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's running in turbo all the time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. B um, four gig for uh, Windows 11 somewhat works. Let me see if I can go to the task manager. This, uh, this one you have to cut, yeah. Oh, maybe you don't have to cut it because this is how fast this is. Okay. Yeah. And actually, I'm pretty good. I'm as fifty six percent booted. Mm -hmm. So um, I have enough space to run anything on this. Moving Windows here is, is fine. Uh huh. And you can actually tell there's a GPU in here, so it actually sees the GPU. Uh huh. Um, the biggest downside is the hard drive. The hard drive is really, really slow. Hard drive in this case means this is an eMMC, so it's a little chip. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it's a very bad one. Can we put the micro SD card in this and use that as a drive? I never tried this. Okay. Because, uh, uh, yeah, well, you Reasons. know, yeah, it's, it's in there, <laughs> so I don't want to have yeah. things around flying there. And the TF probably isn't very good connected, anyways. Okay. If you look at. And yes, this is real time, so this takes, this takes its sweet oh. time. Yeah. Now I see the problem with yeah. this. This is what, what, what you, when you mean when you when you said this is walking along, not running. Um, <laughs> staggering. <laughs> yeah, staggering is a good word. <laughs> yeah. Uh, device manager. Come on, open this. Okay. Well, it did. It it opened something. Yeah. It tried to open something. Sometimes. Uh -huh. This is what I meant. It makes you humble. Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. And it makes you appreciate your normal desktop. You can't tell that, that there's a drive controller, so you only mm -hmm. see the drive. This is a Samsung something something EMC. Uh -huh. And if you look at the OS controller, it says "veraltet" here. This is means uh, out of. Things this is so old that uh, Windows doesn't know what to do with that. Oh, outdated or outdated. Uh, outdated uh, is a good thing. Yeah, yeah. obsolete. Uh, obsolete. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. So uh, Windows runs on this, mm. but well, it works. Okay, I uh, think I know a YouTube channel that we can try try out. Well, what are we going to go for? The electronics one or the one we filmed the Halloween stuff on? Oh, yeah, you can you can do the Halloween thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay. come on, Halloween thing is a good a good. Yeah, we're still sitting here and waiting for YouTube to come up. Um, uh -huh. You saw the little housing there, so there's not much space for having a Wi-Fi antenna in there. Uh -huh. So Wi-Fi is always slow. Okay, which fits to the whole theme of the whole thing. Oh, look at this, Minecraft! <laughs> oh, does it play Minecraft? <laughs> no. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even try. Does it play Doom? Doom will run, yeah. Okay. Doom in a, a very DOS ver version would, would run, yeah. Uh huh. Uh, we want to go um, Gran Canary and Covert, right? Yeah. So we thought you thought we go to the electronics channel, but we're going to do our other channel. So this is the one we were filming yeah. at Halloween, not here to ask yeah. where it was. Yeah. So let's see how this works. Yeah, Rich and Jules went out on uh, Halloween and uh, captured some some. We won't have audio, right? No, we won't have audio, but this is fine. Okay. Oh, 
look at that. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder who that is. <laughs> uh, this actually works. Yeah. But you see, well, I can't. don't know if you can see this on YouTube. This is a bit stuttery. So uh, go for full screen here. Yeah. And you see, when I move my mouse, it already stutters. So if I go full screen. Which thinking about it. And there's oh. a lot of stuff going oh. on. Oh, yeah, you can see the stuttery thing. Oh, yeah, this is a perfect example of uh, it works somewhat working. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it maybe catches up some. No, it doesn't. What resolution is what resolution is this uh, playing? Let's in? see. Yeah, stuttery. Yeah. So we now played at 480. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys. Obviously, we were filming too high a quality of video here for this little machine. Yeah, don't try. Uh, well, it says on the uh, on the AliExpress thing, it says 4K. Of course, it can show 4K in uh, the uh, show. still image. A still image. Yeah, a still image would work great. Anything else? Well, you see how stuttery this is, and we're not we're not doing high quality here. Okay. I can't even stop this. Okay, I can't stop this. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm just skipping forwards a little bit, see how long it takes to catch up with where it was. Okay, here we go. Do we press play again? Try, try your luck. Okay. This was scary, folks, by the way. <laughs> Rich into zombie walk. Yeah. Best shot in the video, don't you think? Doom, 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 doom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think that's enough of that. <laughs> uh, I had a task manager open while we're trying to play this. Okay. Let's see, uh, yeah, and you can tell it's masked. There's your problem. Yeah, the CPU is already running it. Uh, it's masked yeah, out. Sorry, yeah, maxed out. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> you don't have much RAM left, so um, mm. this is short to swapping. Uh -huh. well, Wi-Fi isn't even isn't even the uh, limiting factor here, but uh, CPU and RAM will kill it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and GPU. That's it. That's it. So yeah. we found what it won't really do. What would it really do? Well, you can try. You know, you know, since you are having an electronics channel, you probably want to look for something like a data sheet or something. Okay. So this would be a typical application for you guys, having this somewhere in the in the in the office. And simply using this as to look up stuff. Yeah, I can see that. Okay, and so looks good. All data sheets, all data sheets. Yeah. Okay. I have it. Mm -hmm. This is the site I normally use. Okay. To be quite honest, so yes. Well, we can use it for this purpose. Obviously, mm -hmm. this will work. Okay, so things like data sheet browsing, this is something we can do with this. So yes, it would have a use in the workshop if you don't mind waiting a few oh, minutes. Oh, we got a synchro error. I have no idea what just happened. It's crashed. Okay, the capture. I think the capture crashed. <laughs> <laughs> this is not us. The uh, the machine is still working here. Are we sure? Uh, oh, oh, oh! I simply. Magic hands. Okay, we are <laughs> connecting this into a capture system to USB, mm. connecting it to my recording system, so that was quite possibly yeah. not the computer. Yeah. Uh, I spent quite a lot of time to optimize this win Windows for being usable. I can tell. Yeah, but, uh, well, there are limits. There are lim simply limits that you can do. Uh, I tried a Max Linux. Because MX Linux is the distri distro to go to right now for smaller systems, mm -hmm. but again, the it didn't work better. Okay, so these things are probably best remembered as something that we used some years ago that were mm -hmm. really useful. Yeah. yeah, and for sixty bucks, I think you can get huh. better bang for your buck if you invest twenty bucks more. I think I saw something like a current Intel Nook, which isn't yeah. that small, mm -hmm. but. Uh, is actually workable and actually can play a video without stuttering. Okay, dying. so it wasn't money well spent, really. No, no, no. But <laughs> I, I was pretty sure that it would end, like, end up like that. So uh, okay, yeah. This is what must me being curious. Well, guys, this is what we say on this channel. People say, "Oh, you know, you review something," and this wasn't a review sample, by the way. No, no, no. Jet no. actually used his money to buy this. 
<laughs> okay, so um, <laughs> you can talk about that down there, guys. Let me know what you think about the computer. Let me know what you think about debt's judgment and life choices. And Questioning and everything. Uh, and <laughs> let us know if you had one of these, what you would do with it. Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 What would you do with yeah. it? Okay, so on that thought, guys, thanks for watching, and we look forward to seeing you all soon again on Learning Electronics Repair. Ciao, Ciao for now. For now.